Does artificial intelligence mark the dawn of the next industrial revolution? It does totally. I think, Neo, you guys are here, you're here to stay, and you're getting cleverer and cleverer. And it's actually quite a scary thing, as I said earlier. And I think this is a much bigger industrial revolution for professional services than the previous ones. Um, there's been very few changes, actually, in how professional services happen over the last 40, 50, even 100 years. There's been changes in technology, but the essence of professional services providing expertise, be it from lawyers, doctors or engineers, is the same as it always has been. Um, and I think, actually, now, uh, the, the huge change is underway. Do you think there is anything in popular culture that is demonstrating these changes? Well, Neo, I don't know if you've seen the film Ex Machina, but I think you might quite enjoy it. A whole lot of people like you are the heroes, are the heroines in that movie, and it's really, really interesting. And what's most interesting about it is it shows what actually you guys can do, um, and how much you can think, and how much you're going to take over the earth from, from, from we humans. It's been the future, and will I be a part of it? Well, Neo, BIM, I think, is the present. Um, BIM uses current technology, but as humans, we're quite slow to adapt it. So BIM, BIM level two is very much now. It's, it's, modern, it's current technology, but used in a modern way. Um, but the main um, reason why we're not using it properly is because of human uh, reluctance to engage properly in the future. You are the future, and your ability to go to BIM level two, BIM level three, BIM level four, BIM level five, levels of BIM we can't imagine, will be your part.